A new video posted online by Iraq's Kurdish regional authorities purportedly shows a joint raid by U.S. and Kurdish Peshmerga forces in northern Iraq on Thursday. About 70 hostages, including at least 20 members of the Iraqi security forces, were freed from the Islamic State-controlled prison. An American soldier identified as 39-year-old Army Master Sergeant Joshua L. Wheeler of Roland, Oklahoma, was killed during the raid near Kirkuk. Wheeler was the first American to be killed in action in Iraq in nearly four years. The dramatic video, which was filmed by a helmet camera, could not be immediately verified by the Associated Press. It was the first time U.S. troops had become involved in direct ground combat in Iraq since the war against the Islamic State was launched in August 2014. Pentagon officials said the plan for the rescue mission was to let the Kurdish Peshmerga forces lead the operation. The U.S. Special Operations troops, who are members of the elite Delta Force, were to stay back from the prison compound and provide airlift and airstrike support, as well as intelligence and battlefield advice. However, the Pentagon said the U.S. troops joined the fight when the Kurdish forces became pinned down by the Islamic State militants guarding the prison.